What's up everybody? My name is Alexandria and this is the Foreign Fork where we are cooking one meal from every country in the world. Today we are taking a journey to Barbados and we're going to be making a Barbadian bakes recipe um, that can be eaten for dessert if you want or breakfast in Barbados too. It's delicious and it's really simple to put together and I think you probably will have all of these ingredients in your pantry already so you can make it along with me if you want. Let's get started. We're gonna need to start with two cups of all-purpose flour and one half cup of granulated sugar, two and a half teaspoons of baking powder, a half teaspoon of salt, a quarter teaspoon of cinnamon, and a quarter teaspoon of nutmeg. Now you can use a spoon to just kind of mix it all up and combine it. Now to this, we're also going to add one teaspoon of vanilla. And then I have some water here. And in here I have about one and a half cups of water. You're gonna use in between one cup and one and a half cups. I'll show you what the dough is gonna need to look like. So start with adding about one cup of water into here. So right now you can see this is more of a dough. We want it to be pretty thin and easy to work with. So I'm gonna add the rest of the water in here. You want it to be a thin enough consistency where you can pick it up and drop it with a spoon into hot oil. You want kind of the consistency of um, pancake batter is kind of what we're going for here. There we go. That looks like what I want. All right, so we have some oil heating up on the stove here. You can use vegetable oil, corn oil, or even peanut oil. Any of those have a pretty low smoking point, so any of them will work. When you're heating up the oil in the pan for your bakes, you don't need that much. You just need like a, a little layer on the bottom that'll heat through. Um, you don't want to deep fry them. So if it's too deep, then the oil will start coming over the top and you don't want that. We just have a thin layer of oil on the bottom and then we're gonna drop some of the batter in with our ladle. Cook them until they're brown on one side and then you can flip them over and cook until they're brown on the other side. They're gonna puff up definitely, but they'll look kind of like pancakes. If you have a cast iron skillet, that's also a really popular way to heat the oil. So if you wanna put a cast iron skillet on the stove and put your oil in there to fry, you can do that too. Thank you so much for traveling to Barbados with me today. I had so much fun with you guys cooking these and if you end up making this recipe at home, make sure to leave a comment below letting me know what you thought. If you need full written instructions, you can find them in the description of this video. And then also don't forget to check out all of the other recipes on my website. I specifically have a YouTube video for Barbadian mac and cheese that is divine. So make sure to check that out and also check out all the other recipes that we have from all around the world. Don't forget to put some culture in your kitchen this week and I will see you next week.